Capricorn, welcome to my channel. This is your love reading. Let's see. What do we have for you, Capricorn? Message for Capricorn. We have letting go. Time for you to letting go of something because it's not serving you anymore. be talking about a relationship, something in your past. Let's see. We have the truth. It's very important in your love life. For some of you the truth will be revealed. Do you need to focus, Capricorn? Eight of Swords. It's a lot of stress. It's a lot of worries. For some of you, you are feeling stuck about the situation. Let's see. What you don't see coming. You got the Moon card. Go and say, by this energy. Time for you to face in your fear. You need to trust in your intuition. It's also talking about fertility, your dream, illusion, or secret. Got the moon again here. Let's see, Capricorn, what's going on for you? In your past, Capricorn, that's the two of ones. In your past, you've been dreaming a lot, making plans for the future. It's a wheel of fortune, a change. Come in your love life. Feel like you know what you really want in relationship. For some of you in your past, it was a difficult ending, heartbreak. The three of swords is a loss, a breakup, feeling pain. Let's see what's going on for you at this time, Capricorn. We have the six of cups. The six of cups is a soulmate connection having memories with someone. Someone from your past or someone you know is here for you. For some of you, you are going to receive a gift from this person. So true, it's very important and honesty. We have the Queen of Swords. The Queen of Swords is very defensive because of her past. She's protecting her hurt. She's very honest. She's a good speaker. I really feel like it's time for you to be open. Letting go of your past, of this pain. The change is coming for you. Someone you already know is here for you. With the Six of Cups. See what's going on. We have the two of pentacles. It's you very busy at this time. For some of you, you are doing a lot of things at the same time. Your life needs balance, Capricorn. Can we talk about this time for you to make a decision? Let's see the new future. What do we have? We have the Knight of Pentacles. 
it's slow movement, it's dollars will go. Capricorn energy. Someone is coming for you, this person is offering you a commitment, stability. Okay. Wow. That's a ten of pentacles. Stability in relationship, abundance. It's coming for you in the near future. You can see a big family here. It's you happy. With the death card, it's Scorpio energy, it's a transformation in your love life, okay? It's a beautiful change. Let's see. With the two of wands. With the two of wands in your past. For some of you with the three of cups in your past, it was talking about a third party situation. Okay, just for some of you. So three of cups, it's friendship, it's a celebration. But I see you very strong about something. Having courage about the situation with the star card, it's Aqualius energy. It's about healing in your past. Let's see, with the Wheel of Fortune, it's a change. With the Wheel of Fortune for Capricorn. Six of Cups again. This person, the same energy here. This person is in your past and in your current energy. This person, you already know this person, is going to change your life. It's a soulmate connection, past life connection. It's like your destiny to be with this person. In the near future, against your commitment, it's going to transform your life, abundance, stability. You see with the Tree of Swords, it's feeling pain. Whoops, okay. Can we be talking about the cancer. The chariot is about success, victory, movement, traveling. For some of you, someone from your past broke your heart. Can we talking about the cancer? This person was traveling to be with you and now you're very defensive. Let's see what's going on with the Six of Cups. With the Six of Cups for Capricorn. Need of Wands, feeling really exciting. It's a lot of passion between you two. A lot of attraction. So Knight of Wands is also talking about movement. For some of you, this person is coming for you. Or you're going to move to travel to be with this person. This is the Queen of Swords. It's your very intelligent. You're using your mind, Capricorn. This is the Queen of Swords for Capricorn. This connection is going to be very balanced. We have the Six of Pentacles. Equal give and take. Time for you to open your heart again, Capricorn. This person is going to offer you something. It's an offer coming for you. You need to accept this offer. It's also time for you to be generous. You can see balance in this connection. Those are two of pentacles. Those are two of pentacles. It's you protecting your heart, your feeling. 
feel like because of your past there's a lot of pain. Like this person in your past betrayed you. You can see a third party situation for some of you. you can be talking about Aquarius Leo. Your cancer energy. Let's see in the near future. We have the Knight of Pentacles. So let's go to Capricorn. Another commitment. Where is the Knight of Pentacles? Oh, Capricorn. Wow, that's a high level. Taurus energy. It's a high level commitment. It's a connection with the divine. So for you to have faith. Okay. It's a Myers card. Ten of Pentacles. Abundance. For you and for your family. This is a ten of pentacles, so Capricorn. Judgment. It's your growing learning about your past mistakes. And now you know what you really want in your life. You're moving in the right direction. It's a judgment card. It's a reverse. Connection with your soul. So just cards. It's a positive change for you. What's the test card? What's the test card for Capricorn? And of that again. It's about the truth. Clarity and communication with your partner is very important. Or you are dealing with a Libra, Gemini Aquarius. I really feel like it's you. I can see a hurt sign coming for you, Capricorn. It's in your past. What's going on? We have the two of ones in your past. What's the two of ones? Having strength. So bear cards, ears, using your strength to be strong and fair about the situation in your past. It was very challenging. So bear ears, someone very strong with a lot of authority and power. Wheel of Fortune. It's a Wheel of Fortune. Oh, Capricorn. What? That's the sun, Capricorn. See this person, the six of cups. You already know this person. You have memory with this person. It's the sun. It's your happiness. This person is going to bring you a new light in your life. Let's see more. <sighs> Too many cups. <laughs> Three cups of this. Let's see. Three of swords. Where is the Three of swords? It's feeling pain, a loss. This is three of swords. Okay. We have a man here. I feel like he, a man was very heartbreak in your past, Capricorn. Oh, it's you, it's a man in your life. See, at this time, Six of Cups. When the Six of Cups for Capricorns, feeling really exciting. When the Six of Wands, I'm sorry. Just a Six of Wands. Okay, we have the Tower. It's a separation, you're not with this person at this time, okay? Can be talking about a long distance relationship. Yes, towards authority, legality, the separation, or some legal matters. See, with the Queen of Swords, 
That's so true. Who is the queen of swords for Capricorn? It's a lot of feeling and emotions. Okay. Two of Pentacles. This is two of Pentacles. That's a three card. It's about your family. It's like you are very defensive about your family, Capricorn. So three years you are also growing, learning. I like for some of you, your family Capricorn is going to grow. So in the new future I can see a commitment. There is a knight of pentacles. There is a knight of pentacles. The Capricorn. It's fight, conflict, but it's also talking about a lot of passion between you and this person. Okay. Ten of Pentacles. This is Ten of Pentacles. Whoops, too many cards. This is Ten of Pentacles for Capricorn. Get stability, everything you want. You have a crossword. You are going to choose a direction. It's you making an important decision in the near future. And the test card, the transformation in your life. Like it's about communication, true clarity. What is the test card for Capricorn? Facing difficulties. Going to be very challenging. Simon was going on. It's a nine of swords. It's a lot of stress, a lot of worries, Capricorn system. I feel like for some of you, you're not sleeping well. Okay? It's like you're thinking too much. It's a lot of worries and stress about the situation. You can see passion, the new passion coming in your life. For some of you, it's a separation between you two. You're not with your twin flame, your soulmate at this time. Like this person is coming for you in the near future. You're going to make an important decision in the near future for you and this person. See? With the high princess, you need to trust in yourself, in your intuition. See, High Princess, she knows everything. She knows the truth. Okay, what you really want in your life, Capricorn. We have also the world. It's a happy ending. It's the end of a cycle in your life. For some of you, it's talking about traveling. Okay. It's success in relationship. And with the moon, it's time for you to face in your fear, your shell, your ego, everything will be okay, it's just an illusion. So, moon. Okay, let's see your last message, Capricorn. The message for Capricorn. Oops. Okay. We have official person. This person is wearing a uniform or it's time for you to be in control in your life. Capricorn. What's the property? This cast is just an illusion. It's you feeling lonely or it's a struggle about money. See you very defensive. With this cast, it's also you making plan for the future. 
because I can see abundance for you in the near future with the Ten of Pentacles. And your last card, yes, CF. It's about a loss of courage. Don't give up. Yes, I can see a separation at this time. You're not with this person at this time. But this connection is very balanced. There is a lot of feeling between you and this person. The truth will be revealed. You need to be more patient, okay? And with the two of pentacles, I feel like it's also time for you to make a, a choice, a decision. For some of you, you have options, okay? Capricorn, this is your reading. Thank you so much for watching and being here. Take care. Bye.